Welcome back to all the wonderful Aptera investors, my fellow Aptera reservation holders, and our Aptera curious friends. If you're planning on reserving an Aptera, please consider using my link below to save $30 on your reservation. In this video, I'm going to recap the 14th week of Aptera's accelerator program. My numbers are based on the May 5th, 5.16 p.m. update. Nothing I say in this video should be considered investment advice. I am not an accountant or a financial advisor. Please do your own research before investing, and investing especially in a pre-production startup company is very risky. For those who are not familiar with what the Aptera program is, Aptera is hoping to raise at least $20 million to help reach the $50 million they claim will allow them to start large-scale production. To be part of the program, you must be one of the first 2,000 people to invest a minimum of $10,000 since the program began. The program will be closed once the remaining 988 vehicle allocations are filled. As an accelerator, you'll be among the first to receive your specially numbered vehicle and a few other perks. Week 14 has been on par for the last four weeks of investment. Aptera has now raised over $14.3 million and has reached 71% of their goal. Week 14 investors added another 1% of the total raised by the accelerator program at just under $240,000. The cumulative investment graph makes the impact of the change in volume of investment very clear. You can see the graph has leveled out over the last month. However, there has been a little spike at the very end on May 4th. I don't think it was the force, but Aptera's update presentation, where they talked about the progress they are making towards starting full-scale production. Taking a closer look at how much money was invested each week, you will see that week 14 was a little better than week 13. The last three weeks have shown a slight trend upwards in total investments, but I think that was just the normal variation. Week 14 was not trending to be this high before the Aptera presentation. This bar graph shows the cumulative amount raised each week. Week 14 was in line with the previous three weeks, but the total money raised was a bit more spread out than previous weeks. I added the graph to take out weeks 1 and 7 as they were the largest weeks and did not have any additional money raised. While week 14 looks healthy compared to the last three weeks, you can also see that eight other weeks had at least one person increase their investment, which has not been the norm lately. Looking at how much money has been invested each day shows the real story. The week looked like it was going in a bad direction as investments dropped off midweek and no investments were added on May 3rd. But you can see a huge spike after the Aptera update video. The fourth alone raised over $100,000 or about a quarter of all of the funds raised that week. Investors added per day also shows the same story. Week 14 had a normal investor profile compared to the last four weeks, then spiked to nine new investors on May 4th. Aptera has made a change in how they report how many delivery spots are left. On the left, you can see that they were counting up as the delivery slots were being filled. Since they crossed 1,000 slots this week, they are reporting how many slots are remaining. The weekly chart shows that week 14 added 34 new investors to the program. Again, nine of those investors came on the last day of the week. It is pretty clear that the presentation worked to give Aptera a boost in investments. Week 14 saw a fairly even distribution of new investors versus prior investors. There were 18 new investors added versus 15 prior investors. The percentage of new investors is still edging up to 39% of the total investors in the program. New investors continue to contribute more on average than prior investors as expected. At this time, they account for just under $6 million of the funds raised, or 42%. Originally, I thought a 60-40 split would have been good for Aptera, but if the trend continues, it looks like new investors might raise more than 50% of the total by the end of the program. The week 14 average invested per person has been in line with the past 7 weeks or so. The average seems to be holding at around 11000 per week. It seems most of the investments from here out will be the minimum needed to be an accelerator. This week we have no change in the top 15 investors or changes to the top 15 accelerator vehicle spots. Aptero is also raising money through Republic. Republic is an investment aggregator that allows anyone to invest like a qualified investor in startups, crypto, real estate, art, music, and more. You can invest a minimum of $210 or $10.50 a share for 20 shares. If you invest in Republic, you can be part of the Accelerator program. They will both count towards your vehicle rank. 
I was trying to do an update report on how much money Aptera is raising through Republic, but their reporting has not been very accurate. Last week's report is on the left and shows 1,176 investors. This week they report 1,185 investors, but the money raised is less by almost $3,030. However, from the updates, it seems Aptera has been able to lock in $1,166,361 from Republic to use towards the production of the Aptera. This equates to about 8% of the Aptera's recent crowdfunding raise of a combined $15,459,559.50. Thanks again for watching. Please subscribe, comment, hit the notification bell, like, and share to help our channel grow. And below you'll find links to our website, evolveelectric.org, our Twitter and Instagram.